class 10 children today i will discuss some of the very important questions of chapter 15 three dimensional solids and today i will discuss all about cylinder so let me start is exercise 15 b question number 8 the area of the curved surface of a cylinder is 4400 centimeter square yesterday only i have said Curved surface area means uh, both the ends are open. It is not covered. So just like a pipe. So only the wall portion that is the boundary portion, surrounded portions, its area is 4400 centimeter square. And the circumference of its base is 110 centimeter. Actually circumference means perimeter. And you know when you check the base of this uh, particular cylinder, you can see the base is circle that means circumference of base means circumference of circle that is 110 centimeter now find the height of the cylinder as height has been not given and we have to find the volume of cylinder so uh, here uh, i will start my solution from circumference i will not start from curved surface area uh, because i have to find radius also because radius is not given so i can write now solution circumference of base that is circle is 110 centimeter and circumference of circle we have learned several times it is 2 pi r equal to 110 and 2 into pi is 22 by 7 because they have uh, demanded to use 22 by 7 into r equal to 110 so when you make r alone the 7 this 7 will go up and 2 and 22 will come down 2 and 22 will come down and 110 will remain in its own place now after cancellation i can see here we have 5 into 7 by 2 so ultimately r is 35 by 2 now i am not changing in decimal or in a mixed fraction i am keeping it in the same improper fraction because my question is to find height not the radius had it been radius i would simplify but not required because it is not the answer but it will help to find the answer now i will start with curved surface area whose value is 4400 so curved surface area of cylinder is 4400 centimeter square its formula yesterday only i have told you the curved surface area is 2 pi rh same formula today i will use 2 pi rh equal to the same value 2 into 22 by 7 into r is 35 by 2 just now we got it into h and we have to find the height so here with this formula we will find height and now putting the respective values we can cancel 7 5 to 35 2 to cancel here 2 22 into 5 remains it comes down here and divides with 4400 so after cancellation the height is 40 centimeter so our first answer is 40 centimeter now we have to find the volume of cylinder number two it is pi r square h yesterday only we have discussed this formula also that the volume of cylinder is pi r square h same thing here i am writing and i have put the respective value here 22 by 7 35 by 2 into 35 by 2 because square is there and h just now we got 40 and after cancellation i can see here 38500 centimeter cube moving on to the next question how many cubic meters of earth must be dug out when it is cubic meter that means how many that is question that means we have to find volume because cubic meter is used for finding volume like square meter is used for area but cubic meter is used for volume so and the earth is in the cylinders the the dog uh, dug out to make a well well you know it is a cylindrical shape who's who's uh, actually uh, depth depth is 20 meter here 20 meter deep that means it is the height of the well that means height of the cylinder and 2 meter in diameter diameter means if you make it if you divide by 2 it will become radius so i can say height is 20 meter and radius is 1 meter because diameter is 2 means radius is 2 meter 1 meter sorry now pi value you have to use this so we have to find volume so first i will finish this 
volume of well will be pi r square h 22 by 7 into as a diameter is 2 so radius will be 1 into 1 into height is 20 because the depth means is height because depth we can say it is height so same thing I have used here so uh, after putting the value you you can see here we got this value we could not cancel and ultimately 62 whole 6 by 7 meter cube this is our first answer now second question the inner curved surface uh, of the well in part 1 this same question part 1 above is to be plastered so this so this well has to be plastered all around but curved surface area that means the upper portion will be open and lower portion also will be open only it will be inside the earth but there will be no plastering here at this base and at the top definitely in a well we don't even plaster on the top because here uh, people can take out water from this so this is open area so only you have to do the plastering of wall that means that is curved surface area and the rate of plastering is 5 rupees per meter square so what will be the total cost so first let us find total curved surface area so the total curved surface area part 2 pi r h so 2 is 2 pi is 22 by 7 r value if you know 1 h is 20 and after all here we got 880 by 7 so this is actually not our answer you have to find total cost so the, the cost of plastering well will be as it is 5 rupees per meter square so I will multiply by 5 because this may this much is the curved surface area so 1 meter cube value is uh, the rate is 5 rupees so I will multiply after multiplying I got 4400 by 7 and after division you can see 62.857 I got and still uh, the answer has not come but in finding the rupees maximum two numbers are required but why I did three numbers here 62.857 same answer I wrote but in this way the third value will help us to find the second number in approximately because in paise we need two digits so this third digit will help us to extend this 5 up to 6 so I can you can see here 62 rupees 86 paise why not 85 because after 5 there is 7 so whenever number exceeds more than 5 this digit will increase one step so 5 became 6 so this was our second question let me discuss one more question children a cylinder has diameter of 20 centimeter diameter means you can make it radius by dividing by 2 radius will be 10 centimeter now the a curved surface area is this given 1000 centimeter square find the height and answer will come in decimal and you have to put one decimal place and find the volume and volume also one decimal place so answer will come in decimal already we came to know from the question itself so curved surface area given and radius that is diameter is 20 but radius will be 10 so I, I wrote same radius will be 20 by 2 that is 10 centimeter so curved surface area of the cylinder is given here curved surface area is 1000 same thing I wrote 2 pi rh is the formula of curved surface area I will put respective value 2 into 22 by 7 r value is 10 h is h so you have to find h also height so from here height will come and 1000 is value so when I make h alone 7 goes up 2 22 and 10 comes down 1000 is in the same place so after cancellation 175 by 11 so when I divide my answer is 15 point 909 but I need one decimal place because question demands height should be in one one decimal place so that means it will be 15.9 so it will be 15.9 centimeter because after 9 there is 0 so when a number is less than 5 the digit remains same so 9 remains 9 only so this is our answer now second question is to find the volume pi r square is the value pi is 22 by 7 as radius is 10 into 10 square and just now we got height that is 15.9 so after putting the values we multiplied and here we reached and then this 0.0, 0 means no value so 34980 divided by 7 after dividing you can see the answer has not finished but one decimal we need so 4997.14 now this 4 will decide the first digit 
so you can see it is less than 5 so 1 will remain as 1 so you can see here the same answer 4997.1 why not 2 because the 4 is less than 5 had it been more than 5 1 would become 2 so these all things I have put in class 9 also so this is our answer so children from this video you learn and do some more questions thank you children